Hi, my name is John Decker, PGA golf instructor and author of the book, Golf Is My Life, Glorifying God Through the Game. Today, I want to work with you on, your, on a concept that I used often in teaching, and I call it back and through. And I want you to visualize a swing set. If this club is a swing set, all I would need to do is make the, the person on the swing set, if I was going to push them, is push them back and then they go through by themselves. Just like that. I push them back and they go through. So when I look at when I look at the golf swing from your perspective, from the camera's perspective, this is back and this is through. I make the club go back with my back and shoulders. I make it come through with the rotation of my body. I don't make it go up and I don't make it go down. So if I took someone on a swing set, I've never grabbed someone on a swing set and threw them up in the air. I push them, they go back, and then they go up with momentum, and then they come down with gravity. It's the same thing in the golf swing. That's a true pendulum. That's what you're trying to create in the golf swing. You add the rotation, and then you maximize your power when you do that. So the concept that I, a, a, a lot of times will do with students is, some of my drills that I've done on this website, if you go and look at the board drill, where you push the board back, or whether you take the medicine ball, those drills are going to go with what I'm talking about right now. So anytime I get someone, a student who kind of picks the club up with their hands or picks it up with their arms, I talk to them about the back and through. And Jack Nicklaus would, would refer to it as low and slow. So in the backswing, you're low and slow. You almost have the sensation that you're taking it back along the ground, even though you're not. As soon as you start the club back, it's going to start coming off the ground. So I'll go ahead and try to hit the shot, and we'll talk a little more about it. I'd be extremely happy with that shot. I hit that ball very solid. And again, my whole focus is just getting it started with my back and shoulders low to the ground, using the bigger muscles in my body to do this, to make it go back. Once it goes back, it has momentum because I'm not taking it back real slowly. Now, that brings up a very important point. If you go too fast or too slow, then you're going to have to add power or you're going to have to wait on the club and, and you don't want to do that in your golf swing. The rotation is also very critical. So once I get the club back and I reach back, then I turn it through. Back with my back and shoulders, rotation and turn it through. If you can combine the back swing thought with back, taking it back and turning it through, you're gonna improve in all aspects of your game, especially in the full swing. 